The, the onus is on anybody who wants to believe in a God to demonstrate that there is. Einstein did not believe in God. Einstein used God language uh, as a sort of metaphorical way of referring to that which we don't yet understand. Einstein said, for example, what I'd really like to know is did God have a choice in creating the universe? And what he meant by that is, is there only one way for, for a universe to be? Uh, it's only one kind of universe, or could there be lots of different kinds of universes? He also said God does not play dice. What he meant by that is he didn't believe in Heisenberg's indeterminacy principle. He didn't mean that he believed in God. Some scientists do believe in God, uh, not that many. If you take the elite scientists of the National Academy, or the British equivalent, the Royal Society, something like 10% believe in some kind of God. Uh, when you say you can't disprove God, that of course is true. Uh, there are all sorts of things you can't disprove. You can't disprove leprechauns and, and fairies. The onus is on somebody who wants to believe something to demonstrate it. The onus is not on people who do not believe in it to demonstrate that it doesn't exist. You can't actually prove that something doesn't exist. You can only fail to prove that it does. And there has never been any convincing evidence, let alone proof, of, of any kind of supernatural creator or uh, God.